So, before I start this video, in the description I have my Instagram and Discord, so comment, look in the description and you'll see that, but let's start with the, the glitches that I think need to be fixed before Season 8. I have a few. First, I'm just going to say the loading time. It takes a long time for me to load into the game. Now, I don't know why, but it does take a long time. It used to not take as much, but loading times has steadily become longer. It used to be really fast, actually. They actually made it really fast after Season 7, Season 8. Like, they made it really smooth, but now, in the past, like, few months, they have not made it as smooth and stuff, so, yeah. And then, another glitch... This was a big one that haven't been fixed in so long. Is the auction house glitch. The program to be exact. Used to be where you can see all, all of the programs easily. You know which one it is. Like I use it to review all the promos in every level for once the season ends. Or to get players. Like maybe you want some players from the feature collection promo. You can easily see that, but now most of them are gone. Like, I don't know what this promo is. No auctions. Like, I don't know what this promo is. Well, it's a tough luck promo. I believe, yeah, it's a tough luck promo. But, like, you don't know. Maybe you want to find it, but you don't know which one it is. So, people have to find out which one it is and put it on NV Lama Discord and stuff. Which is sad because some of the promos don't even say the name at the bottom. Like you saw the spring season one say a name. Or right here, you see that. But ones like this, you can't see the name of it. Now it's a free agent promo, but still. You can't even see the name of it. By clicking on some of these. So, it's just, it used to be so much better. And now it's become like this. And then the last glitch, which is the most important glitch that NBA Lamo needs to fix, is definitely the gameplay player models. Alright, it's because this is getting out of hand. A ton of players are wrong. Um, let's just play a random event right now. Sure, let's play this event. Alright, we're using Spell Web though in this event. So I'm not going to play this event. Actually, no, I will. Let me go to a lineup that I know has a player that has a wrong. Let me just go to this lineup. Put in Victor Wembanyama. When B has a wrong face scan. And that's one of the rising stars. So you gotta have a correct face scan for When B, but When B does not have a good face scan in NBA a lot mobile. His model is incorrect. And I know some other players like Pascal Siaka, Mantras, Hero, Luca, I believe. I don't remember. But yeah, you see Wemby having like a mohawk, like long hair, like really long hair, and looking like a white person when he's not white. This is not a good sign for NBA Live Mobile because some players are like different play styles. Like some, I forgot who, but I think they just put some of the similar players that look like someone to be the face scan of it. Another player, like you see T Mac, Tim Duncan, all of them look okay, but Victor Wemiyama does not look like this at all. He is so much different than this. So, this is why they need to fix it because they need to be correct. They also had a dirt jersey glitch with Siakam that has been here since season four and it still hasn't been fixed. But yeah, that's basically it. Thank you guys for watching. We're out.